All right, we will move on from there. Let's dive into the New York football giants. Coach Joe Judge heading into his first season, uh, and nobody even knew who he was until he was hired for this job, uh, went 4-12 and last year, and obviously Coach, uh, Coach Pat was, was let go, and their win total right now sits at 6.5, which seemed like a lot to me. Uh, over is plus 145 to go under minus 165, so obviously they think going under is the more likely play. To win the division, plus 14.50. So, probably not happening this year. Uh, Joseph Gomez jumps in and said, Joe, slip and slide, judge. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's go through some of the stats from last year because that, they, they return a lot. They bring a lot back. Offensive yards per play, 5.4. That was number 20 in the NFL. Defensive yards per play, 5.7. That was number 19 in the NFL. And then turnover margin. And who do I have some stats about that turnover margin? Number 31 in the league. They gave up the ball 1.1 times per game. That is not a good thing. Uh, the question right now is, can you get a big sophomore year out of Daniel Jones? And uh, can can Saquon come back and be explosive after, you know, multiple injuries last year? I mean, he just he could not get right. And he still had 1,400 yards from scrimmage because he was really the only thing that they had. And that that's what kind of scares me is, they were running the kid even though he was injured because the, he was literally the football team. I mean, they, they, I'm not saying they gave up a lot for him, but they gave up the number two draft pick. I mean, that's insane. Uh, Joseph jumped in on YouTube, said plus 1450 is still too low. It should be in the 2000s. Uh, DFS Bachelor jumps in. How many push ups is Joe Judge making his grandpa do today? <laughs> uh, here's, here's my notes on this uh, only Carolina and Miami gave up more points in 2019 than they did. Uh, they added linebacker Blake Martinez from the Packers. Safety, uh, safety Xavier McKinney, their second-round draft pick, who they were kind of counting on to come in and start immediately, broke his foot in fall camp. He is out for at least a few months, uh, a couple of months. It, he might come back at the back end of the schedule. By that, it could all be it call, uh, yeah, I can't talk. It could all be moot at that point. Um, Daniel Jones. Whew. Can he stop turning the football over? He fumbled the ball. 18 times last year. That is one time for every 45 snaps that they took. That is an astronomical number. That doesn't even include the interceptions. That is just ridiculous. He could not hold on to the football. Uh, and, and my other biggest question, do we trust this coaching staff? And I don't know that we can right now. I don't. We don't know anything about him. But I, I know that he was, what, a special teams coordinator? Well, he, he was the wide receivers coach. Uh, okay. It, if that makes you feel any better. No. The Patriots wide receivers were, what, awesome the last two, three years? I mean, they were good, right? They were, they were really, oh, no. I don't right. understand. They what, were I don't know what Gettleman was doing with this with this hire. Dude, this dude, listen, this dude was getting coaching looks in the college world, too. I don't, I mean, in, in this, the college is, this world, is one of those things. I can this understand. is one of those things where networking has got to just be so important. I guess. I like guess. he's got to be somebody's nephew or grandson or something. I've got him four and twelve. All year. right, so I'm a little friendlier than you. I got him five and eleven. <laughs> I don't think they're going to be good. Listen, you so can't either. take an offense. All right, your defense blows. Okay, so you got to be really good on offense. To get really good on offense, you don't add cheerleading Jason Garrett. All right, and Freddie Soup Kitchens. Okay, that that is not how you make your offense better. Yes, I'm not a I'm not a football expert. But I know that ain't going to work. Agreed. Agreed. I mean, it makes no sense. But you got them 5-11, and 11, huh? Got them 5-11. and 11. <sighs> yeah, that's, I don't think this is a good football team. I just don't think it's a good football team. 